Hi guys, I was thinking of calling Tory party chair Jake Berry MP Fool of the Week, but fool is probably too nice of a word for him. Perhaps you guys in the comments section can come up with something better. Anyway, here he was at the beginning of the Tory party conference in Birmingham where he said that people who can't afford to pay their energy bills have two choices, either cut their consumption or get a better paid job. I kid you not. Have a listen to this. People know that when their bills arrive, they can either cut their consumption or they can get higher salary or higher wages, go out there and get that new job. Sure, it's That's the changes. approach the government is taking. You we can are saying, look, let's, let's create, or let's create growth before. so households can afford their bills as well as the brilliant work we're doing on energy bills. Now, look, how do you respond to this? So absurd. It's ridiculous. Now, if this had been some Tory backbencher like Sir Edward Lee, my response would have been, look, it's just per, poor Sir Edward Lee. He hasn't taken his medication today. He needs to go and have a lie down. He's not serious. He's not to be taken serious. He's not important. But this guy, Jake Berry, is the Tory party chair. He's not some backbencher, not some nobody. He's the chair of the party. And he came out here and says, yeah, if you can't afford to pay your bills, just get a better, better paid job. <laughs> the disconnect is unbelievable here. People can't just go out and get a pe better paid job. People are working whatever hours they can to feed their families, to pay their bills. And bills are going up. Inflation is at 10% or more. Especially for the poorer in society, it's much more than 10%. Get a better paid job. Or cut your consumption. What? Well, yeah, just put on another blanket. Go to a warm bank. Cut your consumption to zero. But even that, it, it, these are not solutions. But this is the mentality. Oh, if you're in, if you're in trouble, then that's your fault. It's not our job as government to support people to provide a safety net. And then he goes on to say, yeah, what well, wonderful work we're doing on energy bills. The, the Tories keep saying about how what well, energy bills could have been £6,000, £7,000, and they're only 2500 Now, of course, that's not a real cap. The cap is on the unit rate, not on the final bill. And that's very important for people to understand. Liz Truss has either lied or been confused about this where she said that bills won't be any more than £2,500, which is completely wrong. The unit rate is limited. There's a cap on the unit rate, but if you consume more, you'll spend more. And of course, people who are disabled, people who need to have equipment plugged in all the time or charged up, they're going to pay more. So this idea, so if you're a disabled person and you can't get out of your home, his solution is, well, get a better paid job. Oh, yes, but what if you're a carer? What if you're not working? What are you supposed to do then? Absolutely ridiculous. And once again, you could almost let this pass if this was some idiotic backbencher. But he's a senior member of the party. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think about all of this. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.